my name is Luis Castaño with IEC's Tip of the Month. This month we want to discuss the, the importance of having an empty hopper on a dust collector or a bag house. These bag houses are meant to handle dirty flow, filter it out, and then goes out to the fan clean. Now this is not, the, the, the hopper, which is this section of the, of the bag house, is not designed to hold material in there. So we need to discharge material to, uh, to allow airflow to behave as, uh, as per design. But we also want to seal this area, and that's why we need some sort of an airlock. There are different types of devices, such as a rotary valve or the double dump valve, which looks something like this. But I have been into plants where the grain loading is so low that they simply have a slide gate here, or a knife gate, which is acceptable, but we still have to consider that it has to be discharged frequently, because as soon as material builds up, we're messing with the velocities in here and affecting the performance of the bag house. And then when we want to discharge, we have to bang the hopper, very likely causing some damage. So we see that quite often. We recommend putting the, the appropriate discharge device, which can be put on a timer, so it discharges every once in a while, even on low grain loading applications. But in, in one occasion, we saw a slide gate being used on a continuous use system. So the slide gate wouldn't be activated except once a month, and by then we had a lot of material built up. It is not a, a good option. We strongly recommend having the appropriate discharge device so that your bag house runs efficiently and reliably. If you would like to discuss this in more detail, contact IAC and we can surely help. Thank you.